Hey, good morning and a uh, happy Veterans Day. Gunny, join me on this video. So in honor of Veterans Day and all things military, in today's video, I'm going to review a breakfast MRE, a meal ready to eat. Basically a military ration, something that soldiers eat in the field or while deployed. Trust me, I've eaten plenty of these over the years. But while I was in the Army, we didn't have breakfast MREs, so this is kind of going to be a unique experience for me. Also, stay tuned till the end of the video. I'm going to share with you some pictures of me and my friends while we were deployed in Afghanistan. And if you are a veteran, I hope you go to Applebee's and get your free blooming onion or whatever restaurant gives away free food today. <clears throat> hope you enjoy. Let's get this out onto a tray. Nice. Okay, let's take a look at what we have here. We have a maple muffin top TFF. I don't know what that means, but if you know what TFF means, let me know. Then we have table syrup. Some peanuts dry roasted and salted. Peanut butter, always a favorite. Crackers, super dry. Make sure you have water handy. And then here's the maple sausage patty with maple flavoring. Pork sausage patty, maple flavoring. There's the condiment packet. I'm not going to really go into detail about that. Some sort of orange beverage powder, you know, like Gatorade or Kool-Aid. There's the flameless heater it's used to heat the meal. However, I boiled mine on the stove inside the package. Let me tell you that right away. This pork sausage patty, this thing smells amazing. You can smell the maple syrup in it. Also, let me just tell you that I'm not going to be using the table syrup because if you look at the ingredients, it's nothing but corn syrup and sugar. So there's really no point to that. Focus. There we go. Now, I boiled this on the stove inside its package, and I threw this in there too to kind of loosen it up. So let's put some peanut butter. on this cracker over here. That wasn't enough. Oh yeah, that's beautiful. Peanut butter on the cracker. Now I'm pretty excited about this muffin, uh, maple muffin top, TFF. I don't know what the TFF stands for. If you know what the TFF stands for, comment below. Let's see what we got going on here. Oh yeah, that thing is moist. It smells amazing too. Yeah, that looks good. Can't wait to try that. Peanuts dry roasted and salted. It's kind of funny that they put uh, peanuts in a breakfast MRE. I don't really know how common that is to eat peanuts for breakfast. All right, that's it. No, really need, no need to really open up the condiment package. I'm not gonna try the coffee and all that. But for those of y'all at home, I'm just gonna show you what's inside. The gum for after dinner or breakfast. We have some instant, uh, some instant coffee. Matches. Creamer. Sugar, salt, doubt you're going to need any salt, a moist towelette, and there's sort of, you know, tissue paper. I'm also not going to be drinking this. Hope you're not offended. I'm excited about this. Let's put some peanut butter on this thing real quick. Let's see what this is all about. Yep. That is amazing. It is just really good. It's like eating, I don't know. It's like eating a cake without icing. You can taste the maple flavor in it. That is awesome. Oops. I crumbled into nothing. 
All right, here goes the cracker. You know, even though I complained about the peanuts, it makes sense. You're not really supposed to eat them right away. Put these in your cargo pocket. So when you're out on a mission, a hike, a road march, instant snack. This muffin top, oops, text message. This muffin top is something serious. Don't eat too many, it'll give you a muffin top. Get it? Okay. 280 calories, 19 grams of sugar. I didn't plan on eating the whole thing, but dang, this thing's good. It's kind of buttery too. Let's leave that alone for a second and dig into this. Wow. That's not bad at all. Whenever I was in the army, they didn't have breakfast MREs. This one, I'm kind of excited to try this one for you guys. There's the ingredients. Pork, sugar, water, and salt. Don't see how that could ever taste bad. It's a winning combination. That's it. Now I'm kind of wondering why they even have this. I mean, sugar, sugary, peanut butter. I guess this would go good with the peanut butter. Oh, you know what? Leave this in the package, crumble it up. Peanuts, peanut butter, sugar, bam. Crumble some of these crackers into the juices. Get a little gravy going. Not a bad MRE. That's it, guys. Happy Veterans Day. I'm out of here. This first one you're looking at is just a picture I took with one of the local men in a village. I thought it was real interesting looking, so I said, hey, want to pose for a picture? And he did. I like to tell people that he's my real dad. This next one is my friend Fern Fernandez. I actually went to his wedding recently. I thought it was pretty cool because he has one of those uh, Sky Soldiers Airborne playing cards in his helmet. We're sitting on the landing zone for the helicopter, waiting for the bird to arrive. We're probably going out to some sort of mission, some village. This is my Call of Duty video game pick. Basically, I'm trying to act like I'm doing something special. I'm really not. It's not like there was any danger or anything at this moment. I was just posing for the camera. We're at the local bazaar near our safe house. I remember this day vividly. It was Thanksgiving, and this is what we ate. Looks pretty tasty, huh? This is taken from the back of a Chinook. The Chinook was our bird of choice. It's what got us everywhere as our taxi in Afghanistan. A lot of times we fly with the back down. So there's this beautiful view as you're flying through the country. Here's another Hollywood shot. We're not really pointing at anything. In fact, we probably just told each other, hey, let's point for the picture. I don't know what we're doing. We're on a mission. We're up on the mountain. This is one of my favorite pics of all time. It's me riding a donkey. And you can tell from their facial expressions in the background they were having a good time. Someone dared me to get on the donkey, and I was kind of scared, but I did it. Here are a couple of my friends eating an Afghan meal that they prepared for us. A lot of times the, uh, the villagers were, were real generous and would cook for us. The food was really good, too. Different, unique. Here's a little kid that I gave a granola bar to. I just thought this was really awesome, what they were wearing. Reminds me of a baby dinosaur. Hope you enjoyed. Happy Veterans Day. Smash that like button, comment below, hit that subscribe button, you know the deal, whatever, goodbye.